Nicholas Chabert, big day at Sun and Fun, a TBM 930. No longer is it uh, the 900s or the, the 850s. We're now starting to work increments up between the, the cardinal numbers. What is unique about the 930 above and beyond the 900? The difference between the 900 and the 930 is essentially uh, with the user interface. The 900 had this keypad, the traditional keypad that we all have seen on the G1000. The G3000 is bringing the new landscape layout of the touchscreens, GTC 580s. Now you talked about a concept for you called EcoPilot, in which the Garmin offers a number of options for a pilot to manage the intricacies of a tough flight environment. We have entered the world of talking to machines and hearing machines. We also have a lot of automation. Our systems are capable these days. What is unique as an aircraft manufacturer is to try to have everything combined together. That's what we call the EcoPilot. The EcoPilot basically is mixing an angle of attack information. It will take the great system from Garmin, the electronic stability protection, the under speed protection, and the emergency descent mode so that you can basically have virtually an electronic co-pilot taking care of safety for you. This had to be an interesting genesis as it came forward. What were your customers telling you that uh, convinced you that it was time to make another leap forward with these airplanes? We believe that the market was slowly transitioning from G1000 that had been introduced more than 10 years ago to touchscreen, a little bit like we've seen in the phone companies. But at the same time, we also have to take some feedback from our customers in the way they work through their cockpits. And we were not convinced that providing just one choice was the way to go. And we needed to move with the G3000, which is now the case. First turboprop to be certified and available for delivery. But we also wanted to make sure that people had a choice at equal functions with a more traditional classic cockpit, which is now the G1000. As I understand it, the airplane is available now? The aircraft is fully certified with EASA and FAA. The production line is uh, moving aircraft out of the factory in TARBS. Ferry flights have started with this first aircraft coming to Sun and Fun. And as a matter of fact, several aircraft left this week the factory to be delivered to their customers. Well, it's an outstanding development. We're certainly happy to see it. Not that there was anything wrong with the 900, to say the least. We're looking forward to seeing how this airplane is received, and more important, as we go forward, just how this level of automation is going to be changing how pilots operate with their aircraft. I think uh, when you are going to demonstrate the aircraft, you're going to see what it is when an aircraft manufacturer is really taking the systems and trying to make them smoothly transition one uh, after another and so basically no matter what you do there is no mistakes Aero TV is brought to you by Cub Crafters is unique in that we can design prototype and certify and put into production an aircraft there aren't very many companies in the world that can make that claim Sandia introduces the new SAI 340 Quattro TSO'd airspeed, attitude, altitude, and slip. With integral backup battery, safety never looked so good. See it now at www.sandia.aero.